So all this talk about APIs is uh, making me sleepy. <laughs> so let's talk about something uh, more interesting. Uh, so uh, during the COVID times, we had this uh, quite new, quick little project uh, to help out local developers. So Shorthand is a local developer look there, located in Brisbane. Um, to help them with the uh, development of their Drupal module because some of their consumers uh, of their services are actually um, on Drupal. Uh, they're also trying to build, or they maybe already have a WordPress uh, um, module or whatever they're called in WordPress world. Um, so if anyone's interested, you can raise your hand and build one for, more, um, for WordPress. So anyway, so what is shorthand? So shorthand is um, in the um, um, early before it's the name of the company, it was like, how do you shorten, how do you like a script? Um, so that's quite the interesting name of the company. So what they do, they just create this beautiful storytelling um, stories where you, um, you know how sometimes you end up on the news website and you just keep scrolling and scrolling and scrolling because like it reveals something and then there's a video and then there's a chart that populates while you scroll. So it really um, uh, grabs your attention and uh, you stay on that sort of uh, article for longer than uh, you would usually stay if it's just a bunch of text. So it engages of uh, the user, the viewer, to actually interact with your um, um, with, with the story that you have to tell. So for example, here's a couple of stories that they have that work with BBC, for example. So here's a, a video embed, and while you scroll, there's full videos, full photos, and they fade away, and then they show um, some um, statistics, for example, so there used to be so many visitors to this site and now there's so many and um, uh, there's mix of text and mix of maps and charts and anything else. So the idea is, um, and it's quite easy to build those, um, um, those stories. So that's basically what they do. Um, when you um, create an account, you can create those stories quite easily. And they so it's it's a really um, really cool WYSIWYG with images and JavaScript you can embed and all sorts of um, uh, videos and charts and so on and so forth and different effects and they show you how to um, embed all those things as well. And you can do all the scroller text and images and reveals and things like that. So there's a lot of room to play around with um, shorthand. So in the in a nutshell, it's really comprehensive um, uh, WYSIWYG editor uh, with a lot of capabilities. So, um, the question is, uh, if you want to publish it on your Drupal website, how would you go about it? Because what Shorthand does on the back end, it's, uh, it's a React-driven uh, application. And when you publish it, you can publish it uh, in multiple different ways. You can provide them your um, URL, and they host it on um, S3 buckets or whatever. Um, but you can also publish it. Uh, well, you, you can download it fully, so you'll have the full uh, control uh, where you um, where you store it and how you store it. So you can download the whole zip um, of your story, and it will have all the images, all the interactions, all the JavaScript. So it's co compiled on um, ser uh, server side compiled compiled into uh, plain HTML JavaScript so you can run it in your browser. So for example, here is my story that I uh, built here with, uh, that's how the editor looks like. Um, and here is the story just downloaded 
locally. Um, you can fully um, adjust and place like shorthand log, or you can remove that if you don't need it and um, change the color and just have really like even um, have all sorts of effects um, on your application. And then you can, yeah, it, it's, it's just there. You own the whole thing so you can download it and put it in your own S3 bucket. But then it's a question of publishing it. So if you do have your Drupal website, um, then you can just download uh, and install um, shorthand module that we helped de to develop. Um, so it's available for Drupal 7, for Drupal 8, Drupal 9. Um, all you need is just your um, API key um, uh, to your shorthand account. So you do need a shorthand subscription. And uh, once you install it, uh, you provide your API key. Uh, there is version two only available. Version one is long gone. And uh, uh, you also need to provide the text field format, which is full HTML, JavaScript. So just give it all the rights you can to the um, in the configuration. Because basically what it does, it downloads when you create a story. So let's have a look. That's what's happening. So you'll have shorthand as a um, content type, and then just create um, a story. And then you just have a, um, a view of all the story, um, published stories from your profile. So from here, these are like, I have many more stories, but some of them are not published that you can see the in draft. So you can see only those that are published. You can bring them to Drupal. Um, so once you create the story and save the story, uh, what it will do, it will uh, download the zip file from, um, uh, from shorthand account, uh, from your shorthand, put it into public folder or any folder that you configure for your um, Drupal content, unzip it, um, and reference it to that story that you create. And uh, that's about it. And then um, once it's published, you have your story on your Drupal website. So that's it. You have uh, this really beautiful showcase uh, of um, different pictures and text that can be easily integrated into Drupal. Um, and it's uh, mobile friendly straight away as well. Um, and it's quite um, easy to impress with your content without um, trying to develop any um, Drupal hierarchies to create that sort of thing. So that's uh, pretty much it. So you can try it yourself. You can try um, all the different stories that Shorthand created uh, or editors created using their platform um, and see maybe um, like it's really cool for galleries or for universities or for any sort of ad advertisement agencies or newspapers um, that's sort of the target market yeah so this is my quick uh, visual presentation